Okay guys, in that lecture we can talk about the reverse engineering side in Mastercam. As you know that in most of the time we are creating our toolpad by using the some geometry. But in that case we are talking about, we gonna talk about the how can we uh, create our geometry by using the NC code. Okay, uh, in, yeah that's why in that case we need our NC code. So. We can see the my NC code here. This is my NC code. So in my NC code, of course, and the start part and the last part deleted. So I created that kind of TXT file. After that perspective, I'm gonna turn back to Mastercam. Use the open file section. So I'm gonna cl click on the all type all files. After that, I'm gonna click on my txt file. After that I can create uh, to my um, point and by using the, that stuff. Okay. When you push the isometric perspective I can see the my all my point. After that of course I can turn back to spline line, automatic spline. So maybe I can create my spline. This is my first point and second point and last point that's it okay i created my file after that i'm gonna select all my file after that maybe i can zoom here to reselect my subline after that i can delete and all the point okay that's it okay after that of course if you intend to create your toolpath you need to select your machine. After that, I can create mill toolpad, contour toolpad. I'm gonna click on my geometry, my tool. My tool can be and ant mill. So Okay, it can be um, 10 millimeters. Maybe I can edit it. Edit tool. It can be 6 millimeters. Okay, I can write my feed rate. This is my feed rate. This is my cutting speed. After that, I can create my compensation off. It is 3D. I don't want to use the leading out options. So that's it. I can create my toolpad by using the retract incremental 5, 3 and incremental 1. So that's it. I created my toolpad. As you can see that it is called reverse engineering. I don't have my geometry. I only have got the some point. It is coming from the CMM machine. Maybe other stuff. I don't care. Maybe I can calculate that stuff by using the, some Excel file, some formula. After that, I can turn to Mastercam to create my geometry. After that, I can create my G-code or other stuff again. Okay, that's Mastercam Clue perspective. So I'm going to try to create some education video in Udemy. Don't hesitate to ask me a question and thank you very much.